two planes, one name. But here's the real question. If the A350-900 is already so advanced, why did Airbus even bother making the A350-1000? Let's start with size. Because yes, in aviation, size does matter. The A350-1000 is like the big brother who went to the gym. It's 7 meters longer than the 900, which means it can carry up to 366 passengers compared to 315 in the 900. More space for passengers, and even more crying babies on long flights. Under the hood, both use the Rolls-Royce Trent XWB engines, but the Dash 1000 are more powerful. Why? Because lifting that big old body takes more than just dreams and jet fuel. And range? Surprisingly, the A350-900 wins here with a longer range of 15,000 kilometers compared to the 1,014,800 kilometers. So, yes, the smaller one flies farther. Classic little sibling move. Inside, both planes are designed for comfort. Quieter cabins, bigger windows, and mood lighting that says, you're flying, but make it vibey. So now that you've seen the difference, which one would you rather fly on? The long distance legend, a 350-900, or the passenger packed powerhouse, a 350-1000? Let me know below.